I've been watching uh, John Oliver's talk about um, talking about uh, the fact that uh, that Amazon is not giving uh, employees enough time to like go to the bathroom and things of that nature, and that they're really cracking down on the time that's needed for employees to get to places um, to to fill orders and things of that nature and you know Je Bezos making lots of money and uh, you know and going to go off into space and you know he's a space cadet and it's all he cares about is his own endeavors and uh, he's he's got this mantra of having zero regrets and I kind of feel like I'm in hell right now but um, I think he's going to hell, so I don't think he really cares about going to hell. He probably doesn't believe in it, but we're all going to go to hell. And so, um, just to, you know, that's, I think it would make a little bit less of a problem for um, the people that have to work at Amazon if um, people who pay for the Prime service, if they could, uh, include maybe a 10 or 20 percent margin um specifically you know the option to pay um to amazon uh 10 or 20 percent margin and this is not profit but this is margin to actually um treat their own employees better you know rather than cutting you know cutting them down such that they only make a certain margin of profit, but then offloading the costs on the employees, which is negative externalities. That's it's a negative externality that they're offloading the costs on the employees. The employees are having to work in really hard, um, work really efficiently, and you know to the point that they're they're not able to have time to themselves. And when they do get home, they're completely flustered. And um, I think that as an, as a consumer, I'd rather pay ten or twenty percent tax on top. That would um, that that would permit them to get um, proper treatment. Um, and if Amazon doesn't offer this and and doesn't take this, I mean, they take it as a profit, but the but it's really to offload. The costs that they're requiring of the employees, the the costs that they're offloading on the employees to be completely efficient and work as robots, and um, if they don't accept that that way, we can just start a union, and um, and you know they would probably union bus, but I would require that the government. Um, which will probably be democratic in the next term, um, that we create unionization of the Amazon co company and force unionization on them because um, they are not respecting their own employees. And I work for a company called Kroger that has a union in it. Um, it isn't the best of a, of a union, um, the company is really not recognizing its own employees. They force policy down on us, and they don't really um, pay us um, in in proportion to the amount of policy they throw on us. And that's just going on throughout the entire country. And this greed is throwing us all into hell. And we were going to hell. This whole country is going to hell. If this isn't hell that I'm in right now, it is going to be hell. And I am just telling you this is where it's going. And so, um, whether you believe in God or not has nothing to do with it. We are going to our own destination, and our destination is hell.